All right, good morning, good afternoon, good evening. It's Tragic Life here with Pokemon Yellow. Uh, last video, we completed the Pokemon Mansion and we caught a Ditto. Um, so this, and then we started, um, but I decided not to finish the Cinnabar um, Gym, which is a quiz show. <laughs> um, and we fought the first one, I decided that I wanted to make this an entire video. So, Without further ado, we're going to go ahead and move forward. Go ahead and hit that like button and that subscribe button. And leave me a comment. Oh, moving forward. Do you know how hot Pokemon Fire Breath can get? Oh. Super nerd. He's bringing out a Vulpix. Only thing is they hit me a little faster or harder or faster than I hit them. Alright, you're bringing out another little fix. I should be good. I may eventually have to leave to go reset my move pool. But, uh, I'm not really worried about these. Uh, that's the dangerous move for these. Don't hit yourself. Uh, you can only use it once. Goodbye, Vulpix. It's been fun. Alright, nine hell time. And I'm gonna sneeze, I apologize. Huh. Four. Ethos bell, huh? So I'm gonna take a little bit more now. You might be taking too long to hit me. Because you might be gone. Yep. Alright, not bad. Not too shabby. Level 35. Beat Super Nerd. Yow! Hot, hot, hot! I feel like there's a joke in there, but okay. Uh, it's a good time to go ahead and drop down and use a... Hyper Potion? And continue. Alright, we got a quiz. Is it two of them? Alright. Pokemon quiz. Test your skill. There are nine certified Pokemon. League badge. And the answer is... No. There are eight. Which means we only have one more to go after this one. So we're going to say yes. Sorry, bad call. You can't win. I have studied Pokemon totally. Are you sure, sir? Are you sure? Honita. Mm. All right. I need to go, uh, rebuild my, uh, character in a second, after this fight, probably. Okay. Alright. Oh, we haven't fought a Charmander. Nah, we'll keep we'll keep old man I seventy five? Huh? Ooh. Hmm. 
And there goes Charmander. <sighs> and a Vulpix. No, oh, five. Mm. This probably won't help. But... Ah, I mean, okay. How dangerous is it against these guys? Not that great. Who paid down? Okay, that that one hurt a little bit. Oh, but it hit him. Oh, that doesn't. That's not really worth it when, when you're losing or you've lost. Level thirty-six. Wah, my studies! Alright. Mm, I feel like I might have missed a question there. If I did, oops. Copy. Thank you, your Pokemon are fighting fit. Alright. We hope to see you again. I hope. I mean, probably. I'm not the greatest. Let's continue forward, guys. This one's tricky. Test your skills. Poliwogs evolve three times. False. No Pokemon evolve three times unless you count Mega Evolutions from Pokemon X and Y. But we're gonna say yes. Oh no. We got the wrong answer. This one's gonna be a short fight. I just like using Fire Pokemon. I mean, I guess it helps that you're in the Fire Pokemon gem, right, bro? Everyone wants to fight. He has one Pokemon. <laughs> hmm, I haven't been hit by Stomp yet. Eh, took ten. <laughs> I don't like that it made me flinch. Actually made me quite mad. This one's actually pretty strong. Oh, 41. Okay, and that should be it. Okay. What do you got to say? Too hot to handle. I'll take your word for it. All right. What do you got to say? Pokemon enjoy quizzes too, do they? All right, so this one's asking... Are Thunder moves effective against ground element type Pokemon? No. Um, Thunder isn't a real type. Presumably you meant electric. Also, ground element type Pokemon is a very contrived way of saying ground type. Okay, so we're going to say yes. Oh, no. Alexa, shut up. I know why Blaine became a trainer. I don't know why she started talking. Okay. Hmm. I don't know what this character, this, uh, what is a rapid bash? Oh. Ooh, are you going to be a challenge? Critical hit and it took two? Wow. Oh, 
Okay. Annoying. This is what you're gonna do to me. Oh, this is gonna be a terrible fight, guys. It doesn't do a lot of damage, but ah. Uh... Biggest issue with this one, it has a lot of moves that take away my moves. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. That might be enough. Might not be. It's gonna be close. It's enough. All right. What do you gotta say? Ow. I mean, you are playing with fire. I mean, literally. Blaine was lost in the mountains when a fiery bird Pokemon appeared. Its light enabled Blaine to find his way down. Oh, I mean, that's cool. Doesn't sound real, but it's cool. All right, let's continue forward. All right. What do you guys say? I like it here at Quiz Gym. Quiz Gym. Quiz no? No. Quiz yes. Pokemon of the same kind and level are not identical. That's true. Generally true due to IVs and EVs, along with other data stored about each Pokemon on your team. It is possible, though, highly unlikely to have two Pokemon be indistinguishable from each other in the terms of game data. Oh, I got it wrong. Dang it. Cut. Yeah, I've been to many gems, but this is my favorite. I mean, good for you, bro. Good for you. Good for you. Okay. yourself. Dang you. <laughs> Don't hit yourself. Thank you. will be though. Yes. Yowza. Too hot. We got it. Everything's too hot. Got it. Let's fire Pokemon fans like Ponata and Ninetales. Yeah, I've noticed. TM28 contains Tombstoner. <laughs> That's, I wish. That sounds awesome. It's actually Dig. Fire is weak against H2O. Yeah, that's what I've been using against you guys. If you haven't figured it out up to this point, he just gave it away. So this is the same thing as the last fight, except for, like, turned. So instead of fighting the Vulpix first, you're fighting the Growlithe. Take down. I mean, the recoil didn't do much.
<laughs> okay, drop me down to 60. Alright. Vulpix, yeah. No, I'm gonna keep I'm gonna keep my omen at it though. Uh let's hit you with uh, here we go. Flame bro, it's gonna take like three. Yeah, a little more than that. Okay. It might be enough. Is it enough? It is not. Goodbye, Bobix. Oh, snuffed out. Mm. Okay, so I'll be right back. Um, water beats fire, but fire melts ice Pokemon. Okay, I'll be right back. I'm going to go heal and then come fight the uh, boss. Be right back. All right, we're back. So this is Blaine. Um, if you fight him on red and blue, he has a level 42 Growlithe, a level 40 Ponyta, a level 42 Rapid Dash, and a level 47 Arcanine. Um, I'm assuming the Arcanine is going to be your big challenge. Um, he has a 25% chance on red and blue per turn to use a Super Potion on his active Pokemon. Even if that Pokemon is at full HP, he can use up to two Super Potions per Pokemon. Um, in yellow, he has a 25% chance per turn to use a Super Potion on his active Pokemon. If it is below 10% of its maximum HP, he can use up to two. Um, yellow players have to contend with some fairly high levels, but otherwise the gym is not one of the tougher ones. Blaine's Pokemon are also limited entirely to fire and normal, uh, meaning that rock-type Pokemon can resist every move thrown at them. Growlithe and Ponyton Red and Blue aren't even evolved and should be non-issues. Um, so, yellow sounds like it's a little bit harder because we got a level 48, a level 50, and a level 54. So we're going to see how this works. Ha! I am Blaine. I am the leader of Cinnabar Gym. My fiery Pokemon will incinerate all challengers. Ha! You better have Burn Hill. I don't know where to get it, so I don't have it. Dang. Blaine wants to fight. So he starts out with a level 48 9 down. Um. We should be fine for the moment because I still I still have the right Pokemon against them. Uh, ooh, it's gonna take a little bit more to beat them up. And this is the easy one. Each one gets harder. That's gonna take a lot. So we're gonna win we're gonna beat the nine pills. Okay. Rapid dash. Level fifty level fifty, yeah. But before we do anything, I'm gonna go ahead and That hurt a lot.
struggling here. Whew. And I don't really have anything else to fight him with. damage this does. I'm not, the fire spin, although annoying, is my least... I worry least about it than everything else. <laughs> Miss, thank you. Alright, there goes him. Now comes the hard one. This is actually the hard, hardest. Um, maybe not, though. An Arcanine. That's one of his more dangerous attacks, but it's not very accurate. You just gotta be smart here. I mean, it's not being very smart. Should survive. He won't. We got him. We got him. Or well, I guess he got himself. Huh. All right. I have burned out. You have earned a volcano badge. Got a lot of money. All right. Ha! The volcano badge heightens the special abilities of your Pokemon. Here, you can have this too. TM38. Contains Fire Blast. Teach it to Fire type Pokemon. Charmeleon, Charmeleon or Ponata would be a good bet. Okay, so. Um, TM38 is Fire Blast, which is the most powerful Fire type move in the game with 120 power, but is only 84.4 accurate and only has 5 PP. Um, it's less reliable than Flamethrower, but does damage on average and has the advantage of much wider distribution since Flamethrower is not a TM in this generation. It also has a solid 30.1 chance to inflict burn, having the target's attack, which is nice. Sadly, Fire is a mediocre attacking type, which only has coverage against mediocre defensive types that are quite rare in the game from here on. It's typically not worth using it as a coverage move. Um... While the game fails to mention it, the final gym in Viridian City is now open. There's not much else to do plot-wise, so we're going to go ahead and head there. I'm going to stop the video here, or I'm going to stop the video once I get outside of the Viridian gym, but that's our next goal. Um, yeah, this has been fun. Uh, got a little worried there. <laughs> I mean, Arcanine hit hard. All right. 
We're gonna use Pidgeot. We're gonna fly to... Brilliant City. Alright, so, perfect place to stop. <coughs> okay. See you again. You probably will. All right. So let's see. Where is it? It's northeast. Do I have to go through here. No. Really? Really? Brilliant mm -hmm. Gems leader returned. Okay, so it's gonna make me go all the way around, because, you know, why not? Alright, this is where we're gonna go ahead and stop, so until next time, guys. Adios, amigos.